Our top story this hour, the clerks of both the National Assembly and the Senate are receiving the lists of East African Legislative Assembly nominees from political parties. The candidates who are being considered for the position after being interviewed in May are also expected to apply afresh. Those who desire to serve in the IALA as independent candidates will also be submitting the nomination papers on the same day at County Hall's mini chamber. According to IALA nomination regulations, the Jubilee Party will get six slots out of the nine in available slots because it has more members elected to the 12th parliament. Let's now speak to our reporter Patrick Amimo who has been covering this for us. Amimo, there was a lot of controversy earlier on with regard to the numbers uh, that uh, either Jubilee or NASA would have within the East African Legislative Assembly. What's the latest so far? Thank you, Michelle. The number as it was stands as it is uh, last time when the, during the 11th parliament it was that Jubilee was to present five names to the other uh, then code was to present four names. The list still remains as so. Jubilee will present five names to East African Parliament, while uh, the opposition of NASA will have four members represent, representing it at the East African Parliament. And so far, uh, this morning, what we've seen is that uh, Aaron Duale is uh, I'll come before the committee and maybe just from the pictures, whether the person, the candidate before the committee now, uh, these are before presenting her documents and papers to a class of both houses, is Eunice Wanjiru Karanja from Transoya County. Uh, she's the 11th um, uh, nominee to appear before the committee to present her documents. Uh, Jubilee has presented 15 names. Uh, out of uh, there are those 111 people applied through Jubilee party ticket, but uh, after the party sitting, uh, they decided to settle on on 15. Out of 15, it's the the candidate before the commissioner is the last candidate, and we've already seen um, uh, there is among the among the list to have uh, notable people. Uh, figures are the former Nyandarua women MP Wanjiku Mohia. We had uh, also former CIC chairperson Charles Nechai. We have uh, had former Tiganya East Member of Parliament in Puri Aburi. We had the former clerk of the National Assembly, Justin Bund, who has just come before, who just left the, 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 the plenary before uh, Madame uh, Eunice Wanjiru checked in. Uh, we also have uh, former Kamukunji MP Simon Bogua, who was, who was also presented his document, has been given provincial certificate. We have also another notable figure, is a Bishop Jackson Kipkemoi Kosge, who is, uh, who is representing people with disabilities. And to be the father of uh, gospel singer Amy Kosge, uh, is coming from Baringo County. Uh, we also have uh, other, uh, other, uh, other persons like uh, the former Mandela East MP, uh, uh, I mean, the former Mandela, Mandela North MP that has um, uh, Aden Mohammed Noor, who, who, no, who, who the, the Committee on Agriculture in the last, in the last parliament. We also have uh, the former um, Mandela East Member of Parliament, uh, that is Abdelaziz Ali, who did not contest this August election after uh, Gare Elders from Mandela did decree that those members who are sitting in parliament all were to vacate uh, who were not to contest the August 8 election. So we've seen uh, Abdelaziz Ali decided now to come uh, and try his, 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 uh, his, uh, his, um, his, um, his luck at this African parliament because it not contest the August 8 election. Uh, so far, the ODM party is yet to present the, the, the list of their nominees, but yesterday I happened to, sp to speak to the uh, leader of my minority in the National Assembly, John Barry, who would say that uh, they will be presenting a list of six uh, out of the four slots that they've been given, they'll be presenting a list of six. And among these, they had agreed as a party because the coalition that ODM uh, will, 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 will be presenting two, uh, two names. Uh, uh, initially, it was supposed to present three names, but they decided to surrender one slot to ANC. And also, Wiper Party will be having one, one slot, and, and uh, Ford Kenya will present one slot. So out of the applications, NASA had 58 applications with, with ODM leading at 43. Uh, ANC had four applicants. For the Kenya had three, Wiper had eight. But from the from look of uh, whatever Mbadi did indicate, it will maybe will only have like um, like six, uh, maybe the final list. Uh, we have 24 members from the independent uh, independent candidates who will also be trying their luck at uh, at this African Parliament and other parties also like Kanu, EFP, PNU. They have uh, their list, so they'll be they have, at least we have 15 members from those particular parties. But something notable again before before maybe uh, you, you can, I can ask for, for more is that uh, we've seen that uh, the former Interior, uh, interior C, uh, PS uh, Motea Iringo is missing out of this particular list. Uh, before the, in the 11th Parliament, he was among those people who are lucky to uh, to be nominated. But this time round, it appears Jubilee decided that uh, he does not uh, he does not qualify to come in this uh, in this new fresh list. We also had like that time last time we had uh, the former Jubilee chairperson Nelson Zuya. This time round, he's been uh, he's been kicked out of the list. We also had uh, former East African uh, East African. Uh, 
Yala member Abubakar Ogle, who has also been kicked out of the list. And from the ODM side, you've seen that now there are also changes because now last time we had uh, Judith Pareno, who was supposed to be to, 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 to present Yala as a, a former house, but uh, it happened after the elections. Judith Pareno has now nominated to the, to the National Assembly, and her list will not be on this fresh list that has been presented by Yala. Michelle? All right, many thanks. That is uh, Patrick Mimo, senior parliamentary reporter there, uh, joining us by phone from County Hall. Uh